Hello everybody, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and doing something a little bit different in the video tonight, which I thought would be a bit of fun. I'm doing the 40 question open tag. Now, I haven't been tagged specifically to answer these questions, but I saw the questions and I've seen a few other people answer them, and I thought they'd be a little bit of fun and they're not too, uh, they're not too obtrusive or not too much uh, really personal information in them. But um, I thought it'd be fun to run through them. I'm not really into doing tags and I'm not into tagging other people as I know a lot of people don't particularly enjoy doing it. But I thought I'd uh, run through these anyway. And uh, it's a little bit of fun. If anybody who knows me or watches this wants to do the 40 question tag, I'll list the questions in the description below. So as it's 40 then we'll get going as soon as possible. Question number one. Do you like blue cheese? Yes, I do like blue cheese, Stilton, Gorgonzola, and I love blue cheese dressing, so uh, that's a big fat yes. Number two, Coke or Pepsi? 100% Coca-Cola, full fat, completely standard, don't like the diet drinks. We'll drink Pepsi if Coke's not available, but Coke's my number one preference. Number three, are you in a relationship? No, that's a complicated one. Um, I have been married, um, I am still married, but I've been separated for about, must be 15 or 16 years now. Uh, I'm not actually divorced, um, and I'm on very good terms with my ex, but I'm not in a relationship. Number four, whiskey, tequila, or vodka? Um, I've got to say, 100% for me, vodka. I'm a huge fan of drinking Bloody Mary cocktails, which of course is vodka based, so that's a definite answer vodka for that one number five hot dog or cheeseburger uh, simple answer cheeseburger no further description necessary number six my favorite food now does that mean my favorite food stuff a type of food are we talking about would you prefer seafood or fruit or a specific food i suppose if we've got no price limits i'm guess going to say that my favorite food is probably lobster because I'm a bit of a seafood fanatic and I really enjoy a nice grilled lobster. So that's my answer for there. Number seven, what do you drink in the morning? Um, pretty much a, a creature of habit. I would say every morning for breakfast, I have a cup of coffee and a glass of fresh orange juice. And perhaps at the weekend, I might make a different fruit juice, but always a coffee and always a fresh orange juice. Uh, question number eight. Can you do 100 push-ups? Not a chance in a million years. I might possibly scrape 10, I suppose, but um, it's certainly not something I've done for a good few years. Number nine, your favourite season. I think a lot of people would probably say spring, but for me it's summer, because I like to see the plants when they're in full flower and the fruits are starting to develop and they put a lot of growth on. Um, spring can be a bit of a letdown sometime if the weather's a little bit cold and uh, I end up with other plants with frost damage on them so yeah, definitely for me it's summer uh, number 10 your favorite hobby now you might think it's gardening and tropical fruit growing but it probably isn't I think to be honest my favorite hobby might be travel I like eating a lot as well I like eating nice foods so I enjoy going out for meals and I do enjoy traveling to lovely countries uh, particularly excuse me if i hadn't seen them before but i mean obviously gardening is is a hobby i like classic cars as well i'm really into classic cars and uh, number 11 any tattoos no definitely not number 12 do you wear glasses i think that one answers itself i do occasionally wear contact lenses but yes i certainly wear glasses question number 13 do you have any phobias no None that I can think of. Uh, question number 14. Any nicknames? No, not that people say to my face. I might have had a couple at school, but that's a good few years ago now, and I don't recall them, but uh, certainly no nicknames now. Question number 15. Your favourite candy? Must be an American question there, because um, over here we call them sweets. Uh, my absolute favourite would have to be... Uh, Cadbury's Dairy Milk Chocolate, but I mean, I eat pretty much any sweets. Um, I'm not fussy. If there's sweets, I'll eat them. Number 16, do you believe in ghosts? Tricky one. I'm not 
convinced I can say yes to that, but I've certainly um, had have heard strange noises and things in the past which may well be uh, able to put them down to ghosts. But I'm not going to say yes, I'm not going to say no. Question number 17, your biggest downfall. Very tricky one. Perhaps I'm just, maybe I'm too kind. I don't know. I, I wouldn't say I've got. I wouldn't say I've got any downfalls, or I've done the thing that was a major downfall. I'm sure I've made lots of mistakes in my life, but I wouldn't say any of them are particularly uh, a particular downfall. Uh, question number eighteen: Rain or snow? It's got to be snow. I mean, a lovely coating of snow. It protects the plants. It looks beautiful. We get rain here. Sometimes it seems non-stop, so it might water the plants, but no, rain's not my favourite, definitely snow. Number 19, piercings. No, I definitely haven't got any piercings. Um, don't like that sort of pain, so it's never going to happen. Question number 20, how old are you? Okay, well this, I filmed this video in 2020, and as of today I'm still 56 years old. Uh, but obviously if you watch it in the future, by then I may well be older and you'll have to work it out yourself. Um, 21, French fries or onion rings? Definitely French fries, but I like the thin, crispy, proper French fries as we're talking about French fries, the French style ones uh, that they would have in somewhere like McDonald's. And now I'm not affiliated to McDonald's. Um, question 22, any children? Yes, I have, as far as I know, one biological son. He's here in the house. He's 19 years old. Um, as of this year, um, my ex-wife that I'm separated from has three children, so I've also got three stepchildren. Don't see them very often, but they're all uh, they're all great kids, um, and I haven't got any others as far as I know. But life's full of surprises. Twenty three. What's your favourite colour? Probably blue. I would say it's my favourite colour. Um, I like a nice dark shade of blue, cars in dark metallic blue are nice, but uh, yeah, I'd definitely go with blue for that. Um, 24, can you sing? Um, well, I quite enjoy karaoke. I wouldn't say I'm a bad singer. I don't think anybody watching this would pay to hear me sing, but I'm not going to make your ears bleed either. Not a bad singer, I would say. Um, 25, can you whistle? Um, And also, but I can't. I can't do a wolf whistle with my fingers. Number question number twenty six. Where were you born? I was born in London, in England. I would think that's fairly obvious. Twenty seven. Do you have any siblings? I've got two younger brothers. Twenty eight. Can you cook? Yes, pretty well. I cook every day. Don't like pre pre-made meals, ready-made meals, so yep, yeah, I cook all the time. 29, can you swim? Yes, I can swim very well. Used to be in the school racing team. Um, I still swim quite fast, but nothing like as fast as I did at that age. Uh, question number 30, are you religious? No, not really. I mean, theoretically, I'm Church of England Christian, but I don't really follow religion an awful lot. Um, sadly, I think it's possibly responsible for a lot of the uh, wars and problems around the world but um that's not a reason for not being religious it's just uh, just me i'm not i'm not a regular church goer uh question number 31 shower or bath well for convenience it's got to be shower because i shower every morning but i do enjoy the occasional nice soak in the bath so i guess my favorite is actually the bath question number 32 do you like the big city on nature might well surprise you, but actually I love the big city. Um, I love the multiculturalism and all the different things you can experience in big cities, museums, uh, museums, rivers, parks, wonderful architecture and buildings. But yeah, I enjoy going to the country and the seaside as well. It has a lot of pleasure for me. Uh, question number 33, are you a good friend? Yeah, I think so. I think I'm very... Um, very close to my friends and you know if they ever need help in any sort of situation I'm there to help them so yeah I think I'm a good friend uh, question number 34 ever had any broken bones yep I've cracked a couple of ribs when I was pushing a car and fell onto the windowsill and I've tripped over 
certainly tripped over a brick once and cracked a bone in my foot but neither of them were bad breaks and neither needed plaster um, question number 35 how many TVs um, surprisingly I've actually got three TVs in the house um, one in the kitchen which I don't think ever gets turned on one in the living room and one in my bedroom because I quite like to sit in bed reading and watch films in the evening uh, 36 worst pain ever hmm can't say I mean I've been in a few accidents I've been in car crashes but I don't remember any excruciating pain I mean it's quite painful when I crack my ribs but no I, no, no, I can't think of my worst pain ever. I've never had that sort of... I've got quite a high pain threshold anyway. So, uh, no, can't remember anything that's particularly agonising. Question number 37. Do you like to dance? Um, yeah, I'm not really a very good dancer. I mean, I, I can't do ballroom dancing. Um, I quite enjoy dancing at a disco, uh, either in a club or at a, a wedding or a birthday party or something like that. So I enjoy dancing, but... Um, um, I'm no Michael Jackson, so you wouldn't be impressed by my dancing, but um probably haven't got any rhythm, but I quite enjoy a good disco dance. Uh, 38. Do you like camping? No. No, no, no. I might have been enjoying camping when I was young. Now I'm a nice, comfortable hotel person. Those, those days of ants, insects bitten alive by mosquitoes, draughts, smelly toilets that are blocked up. No, I'm not a camping person anymore. And really, it's not very nice camping in the UK anyway with the amount of rain we get. So I'm afraid it's a nice comfy hotel for me. 39, are you weird? That's a weird question. I don't think I'm particularly weird, but hasn't everybody got a little bit of weirdness in them? Probably in some way or another, someone else would find it weird, but not that I'm particularly uh, aware of. And question number 40 isn't really a question. It's saying, please tag six friends. Well, I'm not going to tag any friends because I don't think that's fair because a lot of people don't enjoy these, uh, these questions. But if you would like to answer the 40 questions um, or some of the questions, then I'm sure other people would be interested to know what your answers are. So I'll post the questions below. And if you wish to do it, you're more than welcome to. So thank you, everybody, for watching. By all means, share this one with anyone else if you think they might be nosy about me. Uh, please remember to subscribe to my channel. And, of course, please uh, click on the bell if you'd like to be notified about videos coming up, which will be going back to plant videos after this. So thank you for listening, everybody. It's Brett out for now. I'll catch up with you in the next video.